Thunder blows online TV. Thunder blows. Assalamu alaikum alaykum barkamu da warhaka barkamu da sake saduwa da ku a cikin shirin mana iya ruwahin da kai shirin tashar gidan television ta na gizo ta tanda bulawas kamar kullun shiri ne da muke ba yan siyasa dama domin su tallata haja su ko su yi shin fida ko bayani mai da martani ko raddi ga al'amurra wa'inda suka jibanci shi annan rikita rikita siyasa a jihar Zamfara a muna nan cikin dambalawar da kitchen siyasa PDP a jihar Zamfara kuma wannan karon a ahalin gidan siyasar Engineer Dr. Ibrahim Shehu Gusau wato Nasiru Ahmad Zabarmo wanda ake mai inkiya da NCC ne sake bayyana a wannan dakin namu domin mu yi bibiya akan al'amuran da suka bijiro cikin sha'anin da kitchen shari'u wa'anda suke yi a cikin jam'iyyar PDP a hiran mu ta karshe da shi ina ji tun lokacin da aka yi rike tare kita ta soma zaben fud da gwani karo na biyu bisa umurnin kotu to yanzu abubuwa da dama sun haru daidai babban kotun tarayya da ke da mazaunanta a nan Gusau ta koma rusa zaben fud da gwani wanda aka yi na jam'iyyar PDP karo na biyu bisa sharudin cewa ba a bi dokoki na dokar zabe da kuma dokokin kundin jam'iyya ba kuma ta haramtawa jam'iyyar PDP tsaye da dan takara a zabu kan shekara dan takara gwamnati a zabu kan shekara ta 2023 da kuma sakamakon rusa karar da shi Dr. Dauda Lawal ya daga zuwa kotun daukar karar ke da mazauninta a Sokoto sanadiyar hukuncin farko da ita babban kotun tarayya ta da kuma yanzu rade rade din da muke ji kila yanzu a tabbatar muna da cewa ya koma filing a ya koma daukar kara karo na biyu kuma inda ya nemi kotun daukar kara ta bada damar jingina hukuncin karamar kotu da ke nan gusau sai an kai karshen sauraron appeal din su da suka yi filing suna kadubalanta hukunci karo na biyu wanda babban kotun gusau ta yi a dama dai ita siyasa shi umwaninta shine kowane irin gida ya dauki mataki zaka ga yana dalilin shi na daukar matakin da ya dauka ba lalai bane mutane su fahimce da lallai wato rational da yasa aka dauki wayan nan matakar ko kuma koda akwai hujjoji wa'anda suka gamsar da wa'anda suka dauki matakan ba lalai bane su gamsar da wani amma dai beauty na siyasa shine akwai bambancin ra'ayi kuma ra'ayi riga ne kowa yana dama ya saka la riga da tambashi a honorable mu ne muka barka da shigowa a wannan dakin a lokuta da dama ba baku hake ba a wannan shirin assalamu alaikum doctor sunana ana sani an ka ni zanje akala wannan tattauna tare da aboke gabatarwa ta kuma kai tsaye zamu shiga cikin gundaren shirin bari mu soma da kai a kotun daukar kara da ke da mazauninta a Sokoto a ta ayyana rusuho a ko kuma ta ayyana jaddada hukuncin da karama kotu da ke nan gusau tai wato fira haikar gusau na rusa zaben fud da gwani da aka yi rana 25 watan mayu shekara ta 2023 kuma ta aminta da dukkanin matsayin da ita wannan karama kotu da dauka a ya kuka ji da wannan hukuncin da daukar a kotun daukar kara ta yi a matsayin ku na waɗanda aka 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 kai kara kuma kuka koma nasara karo na biyu a cikin shari'an to alhamdulillahi ala kullu halin dr anas anka ajiya sarantu da waɗanda muke tare da suna a cikin dakin nan da tanda blowers ina muku sallama irin ta addinin musulunci a da farko a ko da yaushe shi mutun ɗan adam kan nemi bukata ga ubangiji ya biya maka ya kamata kai hamdala kai mai godiya wanda yake cikin waɗannan godiya ma akwai lokutan da zaka ga mutun ya gitta yayi azubi ya ce sadaka ce zuwa gare shi so a laƙiƙa nan gaskiya farin ciki da murna da muka yi na hukunci na farko da aka yi a nan firar haya kwal gusau to sai ya dan ƙara percentage inda can 70 ne sai shahi allon 100 bai rage ko ƙarɗan ba because a dusar da aka ci zarafin ka ko aka ci mutuncin ka ko aka hakana maka haƙin ka kai yi fashuwa ne haƙin ka to ya zama tilas in kai nasara ga wannan al'amari ka ji dadi so takaitattun ansa shine nan mun yi godiya ga Allah kuma mun ji dadi kun ji dadi yadda hukunci ne 100% 100% waje yanzu yanzu a hukunci na biyu da shi ita babbar kotun dauka ka kara ta sakoto a da wanda nan fara high court hukunci na biyu da aka bayyana hana mu PDP tsaye da dan takara yanzu wani matsayi yake for now eh matsayin da yake ga wanga lokaci still in force yeah, it is still in force okay dalilena kamar haka shi dai hukuncin ga dogam kan shi na farko ma kamar ya daddaka ma ita uwar jam'iyya da shi dan takarar da aka ayyana dr 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 yace primary cewa a je a sake yi amma da aka koma ga hukunci na biyu shi lawya duk aka kara zama na sauraron shari'a ko da yaushe akwai abinda suke kira 
final written address mm. me kake son ko ko tu taimaka ko bisa abin da ka dogara bisa ga abin da ka dogara gare ma'ana da hujjojin da ka kawo dan duk wani exhibit da kai attachment mm. so bayan duk prayers din mu da muka yi kamar addu'a ta farko da muka yi gaban kotu shine da shari'a ta biyu ya shari'a ta biyu shine primary election ma na biyu a sake roshe shi bisa ga cewa is mad of irregularities matsalolin nan suna nan ya da suke baba abin da can babu abba da rasin da aka koya babu da rasin da aka koya na biyu addu'a mu ta biyu shine kotu ta bada order cewa INEC kada ta karbi dan takara wanda jam'iyyar PDP za ta mika sunan shi da sunan shi a dan takarar gwamna kada kuma ai publication kada ai komi da shi pending abun da ya sake biwa baya daga can karshe sai shi council din mu da sauran team din shi suka yi wata addu'a that an any other order the court fit it deem necessary wanda take da da wani umurni da wani umurni da ta ga ya dace da shi to bisa ga dalilan da yasa aka rosa primary na biyu shi na farko an je in conformity na doka ma'ana notice inda an ka ba ainak isa shi ne na biyu jam'iya ta bi doka na ba yan takara seven week days ma'ana notice bakwai ta ba da su na farko shi ne a list inda aka zo da shi na delegate it was certified through copy by INEC da ka samu hannu ta zo da shi kaga primarily an bi wasu ƙa'idodi an bi wasu ƙa'idodi ga wancan sai dai shi na farko sannan kowa ne ga doka paragraph 8 sashi na a ba cha ina ganin na PDP constitution yace tabbas ba ra'ayi bane wurin composition hada tiri tiri delegate daga kowane wadannan mazaba daya dole ya kasance mace ce kuna saran mace 140 muna saran mace 147 ni as an agent na honorable doctor engineer ibrahim shehu bakawe gusau to my utmost surprise na sha mamaki mai nawi ko da na je mai makon in ga sunan mace 147 ga delegate list sai na ga kwara uku so kaga haki na mata an yi denial din shi kuma is a sensitive issue is a sensitive issue gender gender accreditation kamar member na electoral committee da aka turo daga Abuja ya rubuta Mr Jude ya rubuta minor report yace by doka ta constitution a fara accreditation by 8 in the morning amma har karfe 7 na murece at the time da ya ba wurin ba ai accreditation ba don haka ko tantancewa ba ai ba to wanda baka tantance ba ya an ka sani ko mutane ne an ka tantance da Muhammad da Shehu da Sani ko kuma a a balki su hajjia saratu sun yi to daga tudun wadawat ko kuma ba da waki ko galaji ita din mace ita din mace so dukkan wadannan abubuwa suka tattaru aka amfani da wannan dama aka rosa primary na biyu wanda shi ya haihuwar na farko wanda shi ya haihuwar da cewa jam'iya bisa ga wancan hukunci na farko ta je ta sake umurnin da aka bata primary sake primaries wurin sake primary din sai aka sake gitta mu duka dokar da aka gitta ma babu inda tsari layi kwara guda ga constitution na jam'iya ko na kasa da yace jam'iya na da damat gudanar da zaben delegate so biyu ga shekara to aka je aka sake abinda sun ka kira repeat na mai da matan nan 144 wadanda an sa su an ka cire su to an yi din an yi okay na dai kenan na biyu da sam doka da tace ka ba mutun kwana bakwai in yana takara cewa za ka yi primary ba a ba mu ba na uku sai aka saba ma sashe na 82 sake layi na daya a cikin electoral act as amended 2022 wanda ya kudi karara a will quote mm. cewa for any political party to hold any congress meeting na jama'a or convention must underline it yes. give three weeks mandatory notice at least three weeks so kace at least yeah. it means ana ba ana iya ba da abun da ya hina yes. amma at kaya least kasa. kada ya kasa that is that yes. subsection 5 of section 82 sub 1 of the electoral act 2022 as amended shi kuma yace failure for a party to comply with abinda section 82 yace sub 1 duk abinda sun kai ya kira shi nullity null and void of no use ba amfani kenan ba amfani ba abai ainek 
3 weeks notice ba 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 en takara 7 days notice ba kaga wadanga biyu an saba musu ai convention so biyu kun ka ce then sai aka sake dawowa kuma bisa ga wannan roko da shi lauyan mu yayi cewa da duk dokar da ita kotu ta gani kaga bai yi limiting din ta ba to shi alkali da ya daga huska shi ya tai canga dokunan nan na zabe electoral act na 2022 sai ya hango section 86 to shi kuma ya ce party that refuse to comply eh with abun the party constitution din ya ce da abun da electoral guideline na party ya ce da kuma electoral act wurin gudanar da primary to ko sun yi primary in an samu aggrieved member ya je kotu daya daga cikin yan takara an ka tabbatar da wadannan sun faru wannan partin kada ya cika gibi da wannan dan takara shi ya jaddadar da hukunci na biyu cewa as far as 2023 election pdp ba ta da dan takara ko ta ida kar samu ko aiki ita ta ida aikin mu mun ce duk abin da ta ga ya kamata sai ta hango ya kamata ta hango 86 sai ta yaba mu hukunci sai ta yaba mu hukunci to a yanzu ina gaskiyar cewa an dauka karar wanga hukuncin na biyu ga dade dade din da muka yi don mun ga wani notice na yawo ranar da an kai hukuncin kotun daura kara mun ga notice na state of execution to ina gaskiyar cewa matsayin ku tunda yan dauka karar ku ne za a kai shin kun samu detail na cewa an dauka karar hukuncin na biyu dr anas aje a sarauta da nake da nake magana da ku a cikin wannan daki mai albarka kafin in amsa wannan tambaya akwai abun da ke ba ni mamaki wanda ya hana ni kwana shekaran jiya to menene shi da na tsaya ina nazari kan shi a wanda bai sani ba ya aikata ba ya da nahi a muna da tambaya ga wanda ina zuwa to ita kanta ka cokam da an ka ce ana jin rade rade an daga kara eh don mun ga abu na yawo a social media to abu a social media yanzu wadanda adda karatu yanzu ya je daidai da ra'ayinsu ko karya ne zasu yadda da shi haka ko ba haka ba in kuma ya saba mu ra'ayinsu ko gaskiya ne ba za su yadda ba mu as far as Ibrahim Shehu daya daga cikin wadanda ke jayayyan nan da nake magana a madadin shi shine har yanzu yau da nake nan dakin nan naka ina bayani yau talata 20 yau talata 29 ga wata men notice of appeal na sakon judgment bai zo muna ba bai zo ku ba na dai kenan na biyu naji waiwai motion na stay of execution din da aka cewa an shigar ni ma kaina ga social media na gane shi shi kai ne notice in na stay of execution as at yau 29 ga wata talata kenan da nake nan tare da kai ba hisabin din ku ba ban ji shi ba because in ya kai ga hannun council din ko whatever ai in kana magana in ya kai ga Ibrahim by implication as far as zamfara is concerned issues of this nature ni dan zabar mani a Ibrahim tunda ne yake dubi da Muhammad bin shi to so be zo ba so wannan notice din har yanzu ku officially ba ba ku officially amma mun sanda tafe yake so kamar da nake nan da kai akwai possibility ma gobe hausati guda da falin within wadannan abubuwa ni ce gobe na ce within wadannan abubuwan da ake magana akwai yuwuwar nan da nake cikin dakin nan kila notice din ya kai amma dai kafe amma dai kafe in shigo kare uku to ban ji cewa notice ya zo ba so kaga abu biyu ne eh shi motion din da aka sa na state of execution ba filing motion sai da substantive appeal yawa to shi sai kaga sai substantive appeal an yi abin da suke kira transmission of record daga federal higher court zuwa court of appeal in ya zama successful dan daga nan if akwai wani motion ko na wannan state of execution bin it preliminary objection da ake so a raise by both the either appellant or dependent so bakin nan zai taso ha ko magana mu je taron da aka yi to the best of my knowledge is unlawful is unlawful is unlawful because to the little knowledge i have good and fine shi muke kira content cin zarar hukunci good and fine doctor kai ne yanzu ka hai hida za ka baro gida yau ka ce in ya dawo makaranta on whatever reason kai hai hida ba kada hai hita ba ma kada ya kawo bakin gidan gidan nan so to you are surprised ma sai ka ka hanya kai ma ka dawo ka hin su tashi makarantar ta kana bakin gidan ga banka kuma ya hito ya hita ina ganin ka ma ya ci zarar hinka to is exact scenario da ya faru one 
judgment the akai and you dismiss an issue on the ground of a preliminary objection the makai is a mood dependent so why it's a court of appeal appellant court but the even jurisdiction to entertain the case because we proved beyond reasonable doubt that acquire abuse of court process if a judgment is delivered the court to the option are two if you concede to a judgment you have no right to appeal to it that if you want to appeal kuma you don't need to concede to a judgment they concede to a judgment and conducted another primary eh ni na ma magana hukunci na biyu da hana ina hada maka ai cewa ba dan takara ina hada maka ai to bisa ga wannan da an ka tashi judgment first and foremost abinda na ji ga bakin shi alkali wanda at lead judge din because judgment din ina son mutane su sani is not two against one no is unanimous judgment by the three judges babu one lead ko kuma splintered judgment babu lead splintered lead judge in shi ya karanta a madadin saura kuma ya karanta nasu judgment that they all conquer with him agree with abinda yace they have no objection so bisa ga wannan hukunci da yayi one ya fara korat appeal in strike out kamar yadda ya kira shi ma'ana ya kore shi because he prescribed appeal in as an academic exercise wato kai rubutun masana masana ne dai rubutun sun rubutu ne aje bore court amma babu inda doka an ka shehe da gare ta cewa bisa ga doka ta kaza ta kaza bayan ya korai abun gane da in ka take san kasan miya misali kafar rago haka nan in an ka datsa ta datsi biyu eh kariya ta zai maka wuya amma in an kai kwace kwace da ita to yaro ko dan shekara guda sai ya dauka sai ya fit 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 da shi ya rarraba nama da nama so haka yamma hukuncin bayan ya kori appeal in on the ground of the preliminary objection the mood dependent mun kai raising challenging the jurisdiction of the court to entertain it sai kuma ya koma baya ga hukuncin da ita federal higher court ta yi a gusau daya yace but in the babu inda ta saba mu doka to na biyu ya jaddadar da hukuncin da anfi ko ba haka ba so bisa ga wadannan da yadda ya bude shari a sai ya nuna one an kore appeal two an jaddadar da hukuncin da aka yi so sai muka dawo yanzu ga second appeal second appeal wanda second appeal no second judgment ah second judgment wanda second judgment is it wanda kace is enforced is enforced amma yet to this as mu har yanzu notice be zo muna ba shine i is enforced that is abinda ma nake so in kare clear prior nan wurin shine abu kwara guda should in case we receive it yanzu within this period da muke muka magana First to consider is stay of execution that's okay apply. Yes. Stay of execution even if we collect the notice. Yo. Mm. On the point of law, we have number of days that we will reply to it. Okay. When we reply, aka tura mu court of appeal Sokoto. Court of appeal Sokoto will transmit electronic record to Chan president it appeal. Then she will assign the judges and send them down to Sokoto suzu then they will inform the council of what appellant waɗanda suka sa da kuma mu dependent cewa rana ka za a zo court of appeal sakota za a yi argument one notice bai zo muna ba two kwanakin da mai kamata mu yi reply ba su ko harawa ba le su kare three ba a yi assignment ma judges din ba da su zo four ba a yi fixing ranar da za a zanna a ce an yi argument kan sakota matan from in the pre election matter an ce in the next 10 to 10 days is elapsed is elapsed generally because new practice yanzu na electoral act she ne duka pre election matters were prescribed as time bound yes. they must be finished before it the 90 days to the 90 days to the poll which in the akafito ana a duka pre election matter har mutun ya kusan kare tenuwa to magana gaskiya we have to be grateful to god that judicial system in nigeria are taking a proper dimension now to yanzu e to yanzu tun da kun ce daron da is on local is on local mataki ne gaba da za ku dauka mu in person eh tun da ku a beneficiaries na judgment din ai yeah so don haka yanzu idan kun ce is on local to maybe za ku zargi issue na contact na judgment din na judgment so akwai abin za ku dauka ku kumbar mu Allah the basket remain closed all i'm telling you is we will do needful ga wannan judgment abu mu ji hajjia honorable rabi rabi na yawo cewa ana jabda yin shi da shi a a eh Okay tambaye kitchen da dauka ko to ana dabda yin sulhu da su da dabda ana dabda yin sulhu da mu da dr Rora London 
so a ja sare to bayo ina zuwa ina tare da ni ta wai sun huza ido ya ina zuwa ina zuwa ina zuwa a ja sare to bayo name sare to is like the name is communicating to me cewa yana nake musulmi ke ba musulmi eh kware ku ga aka kawai yanzu yau talata mutun ya ga yake sai gobe a ce a zo a daura uri kan da bi possible a a yau ya ganta gobe a daura uri kana yi ne mu koma mu Allah zai yi wuya because akwai protocols inda sai an bi su one bayan sun hadu da juna sai sun yi da juna sai sun ga uwaye sai an yi siga sai an biya su daki duka a kare su in 24 hours ina son ki an sami tambayar ne in that possible ko ba zaura ne ya balle mu ina ganin an saki ta zo no ko eh eh gwai sulhun da ba a fara ba as at one ga lokaci da nuka magana in an ce abu ya zo dab ma'ana akwai stages din da aka biyo wanda an kawo ya zo dab wannan to hukuncin da an ka bai na biyu ba an ce suna nan suna kokarin su neme ku dai a dai kai kance ku aje makaman ku ba an ce tun ba da hukuncin aka ta kokarin a same ku shin me yasa ba ku samuwa abinda nake fada maka guda abinda kake fadi biyu ni na fada maka guda na yadda sulhun nan in ma za a fara bari in zama too open and direct da yes. Anas Anka mm. har in akwai matakan da an ka biyo mm. to ba ta biyo matakai na kware ba to amma gaskiya ne kun kibari a same ku ba mai riccin out ba mu kibari ba dan babu wanda ya iske mu har yanzu da aka magana ni kai maka waga magana ta dai kenan sannan in kai ka tuntube mai gidan ka cewa har yanzu ba su tuntube shi ba na na cewa har yanzu yan bangaren dr dauda ba su tuntube shi neman sulo ba ai in fada maka in fada maka ko na tuntube ko ban tuntube ba this is our family affairs so akwai limitation where i can go ni to akwai yuwa kina ana ana magana da shi kenan ni ce maka ka fahimce ni an yi tunanin ga masu tunanin an yi bayan ba ai ba ko ba haka ba shin a takaitattar magana kana sulhu da wanda ko kasa ga bayanan a to kuma ba ba shi ba wanda ya sagare dole sai da shi za sulhu babu ba wanda ya sai ya tsaya mai sulhu don in bai na shi kenan ko mai sai ya dawo fundamental right din shi ne mu lutanant ne ga rai ai in ya dawo an kai magana da shi lokacin zai tuntube mu mi a ta mu shawara in mun aminta tsaya mana ban ce a a ba amma yanzu mu ba mu da locals na cewa mun ba da da ma za a sagare shi ba kenan ai rashin isa ga rai kwara guda ce cewa shi at the right ya ba da dama haka da zama to tunda bai nan a kin sai na ba ya magana da shi ta waya eh ba ya neman shi ko ta waya a kwara ku ya wakilta ku a zauna in terms din ya gamsu da su ya ba ku dama to ai kaga in an ka ce magana waya magana ce ta zaka zanna waya da ake gani ana ba ta wani paramount important wanda bata kai ba tana da limitation na harkokin da ake yi ne da gobe magana ce wanga ta ayi tabling issue ga ta saraice kamar yadda ka kira wanga program da wacce kan zo komi sai an zanna an zazzage abubuwan nan kan table bari in ji ha ma yanzu yanzu muqaddara a neme shi kuma ya fadi inda yake zai yi ba dama a cin maitan aisulhun da shi to dai bai dawo a in ba zai dawo ba yanzu eh kamar misali a kaddara yanzu wasu wa'anda sun ka isa ga dan dan takar su neme shi don sun isa kana ina ya ce kila let's say ina nan gana kila misali misali kana ganin ba zai ba da dama in gana ta ci a cin mai a cin mai a zauna da shi don akai kashin matsalar ga akwai kalma guda da kan fadi kana gani an sa e a a why because boy ya sanin abin da a cikin zuciya ta zai iya aminta ba zai iya amin ta ba siyasa haka da shi ka san me ka yi ka san abin da ina da limitation na sanin me ya ka iya yi kai matsala kenan to muje a ya kuka ji da kuka ji kwatsam ga hukunci ya zo kuma aka ce a ayi sulhu da dan wanda kuka shari'a jointly ta da shi hafiz la hukunci ina gaske cewa ayi sulhu official ya communicate muku cewa shi ya sulhu don mun ga hoto na da yawo kuma an ce shi an kai karshe ayi sulhu don mun ga hoto shi da dauda a social media ba mu san haƙiƙanin gaske hoton ba tsohon hoto ne sabon hoto ne ba mu sani ba amma dai abin da ke yawo a yanar gizo Hafiz ayi sulhu da shi in haka ne ya kunka ji ka kaddarta ba an yi sulhu da shi mm. ya da an ka zo mm. wadanda adda suit din masu jayayya mutum biyu ne mm. da Hafiz Muhammad Nahu da su uku ma sun ka hara engineer Ibrahim Shehu mm. da shi malam wadato da ya jayi da baya ya eh. farko mm. to the same scenario da ya faru a 2019 mm. daga G8 sun ka faru sun ka koma G little number karshe sun ka koma G kwara guda amma sai an haka ya karshe aka yi hukunci don haka yadda ta ji ga social media haka ne ji tunani na inda zai iya aminta da cewa tabbas sulhun da aka hade an yi in ji ga media karara ni 
Hafiz Muhammad kamar yadda shi malam wadatau yayi yes na aminta da sulhu da Dr. Doda Lawan dare na yi mu bayi a gare shi zan ba shi goyon baya ba ni da sauran jayayya abubuwan da suka faru kwa da kin baya mun yafi juna to banji wannan ba hoto na social media you can add one plus one to it shine ni cewa mu ma a social media ba ni da yakini iko a a kuma har in akwai yakini haka nan ta faru ni abinda nake son ka sani Dr. Anas is not my primary responsibility na shirin su ko rashin su eh dalili shine ai abo shi abokin jayayya ko wanda kuka jayayya tare da shi a gidan shi wanga dan takara of course so kuma idan yau aka ci wanga abokin tahiya kuna ta ya kwatsauce ya ci ya hasa zai koma inda hito misali dole zaka ji ba dadi domin akwai destination din ka kasanku kai tare da shi yanzu inda za a tabbatar da shirin ko yayi ko bai ba an yi judgment na farko wanda ke jiran kira daga zuwa supreme court inda wanda dubba ya mai daidai bai gaba mai daidai bai ci ko kuma wanga appeal din ko kuma wanga appeal na biyu da ake ci eh so sai mu jira in ya tura council for withdrawal daga cikin case din shirin ya tabbata to ai lawan ko goda eh ai lawan ko dai yana iya bashi yana umurtu yana iya dukkan nan cewa ya hita to sai mu jira amma dai ku bai muku wani formal communication ba officially ba ta zo ba ya fita to yanzu a ah, bari akwai tambaya ta goda sai ke dauki taki a ah, me kake ganin zai faru idan kotun daukar kara ta ba da wanga state din ta ba da yanzu wanga shari'a ta biyu me kuke ganin zai faru idan suka yi nasara aka ba ku notice suka ce kuma akai garantin stay of execution to amma stay of execution kamar yadda na ji masana sun fadi kuma haka yake mm. a ah, new practice na ita court of appeal practice direction practice direction mm. ya hana about the state of execution the any political petition ko kuma any political case why because electoral act 2022 as amended prescribed all pre election matter and the petition as time bound dole su kare kafin zabe don haka rayuwa gare su babu wannan an dakatar da wannan to kana ne practice ne na court of appeal to kana ne ko yanzu wanga motion din bugun lada za a make it is an ordinary argument na na ce to kana ganin ba zai yi nasara ba shine ne fada maka taruwa kawai za a yi koto a karanta but at least it will be tracked out to maje wa na ta maka wancin iya koto ana yanzu karshen ta za ku ja musu hasarar ba dan takara akan wannan jayayya da ke sai ba ka bugun jiriyar kudi ku kare ku je abin da ya samu kuna garin ba ku ne aji amma rana wanka inji ba haushe ce ba a koyon cibi ko kuma ita amarya abin da agare shi za ta ba angonta tunda nazo ranan nan ga ni ga ko yau bari in bude miki ita karshe ki gano dalilin da yasa ba za mu ji ko bi ko da an yi haka kina bi na in 2006 honorable dr engineer ibrahim shuhu bakoyo goso was the general manager night she a first academic doctor in the history of nigeria wanda ya karanci mobile and telecommunication 080 ta farko da an ka halitta nigeria shi ya halitta ta shi yayi designing software application da aka tura hoto daga waya zuwa waya da duniya shi ya saukar da yan network open all these opportunities da agare he made up his mind ya iske jibu a cikin jam'iyyar PDP a nan jihar Zamfara wanda ka fada a ji wanda shi a uba wanda shi a kowa yace ina da ni son in yi takarar gwamna 2007 mi a shawarar ka wanda shi ya kasance amini ga mahaifin honorable engineer Ibrahim Shoba yace ka je ka aje aikin ka bayan ya aje aiki ne ya dawo yace ka yi hakuri Ibrahim na kai karshe zan yi takarar shugaban kasa ne ma bai yiwa kai daga guso ni daga guso shi a dalilin da yasa malaya ya Abdul Karim ya zama shi a black bear na PDP 2007 aka je primary da 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 mai fada aje a PDP a jihar Zamfara ya samu kura'a uku a wurin primary do not west ibrahim shehu ya abaya ne an kai wannan an hakari 2011 ibrahim shehu ya koma ya ci gaba harkoki ne ne da gobe yana kasuwanci ne yana da kamfanin ka ne na software application ta sauran abubuwan da ya saba ya ci gaba ya kuma ga dan uma ya ci gaba da abubuwa ne aka zo aka samu faraka a 2011 tsakanin gwamnati mai ci ga wannan lokaci da wanda a sanadin ya zama gwamnati shi dan shiga tsakanin shi the same ibrahim shehu single handedly ya taimaka mu anpp ta wannan lokaci da gudunmu wa kudi ba rance ba 150 million aka zaga ya fotin local government an haƙaddamar da jami'an ba bayan an dawo 
aka ce je ya takarar senator senator distinguished kabiru garba marafa i quote with no regret ya iske mahaifin ibrahim shi yace ni ina son in yi takarar senator shi kuma ga lokacin nan pdp ta sawo shi gaba ba ta da bukatar bashi take duk da shi adda mutane ibrahim shehu baba ne kira shi yace kai kai hakuri ibrahim yayan ka zai je senator kai ka je rep that is how he become the rep between 2011 zuwa 2015 in between wannan period din ba man ga tukure aje mukami na national chairman na pdp aka kira madu sharif former governor na borno state aka ce da kafatin duk Allah ka da lalace the same madu sharif send a delegate to come down to zamfara and conduct election na esco former chairman din su lokacin hasan nasiha run to prayer higher court institute a case cewa ta yana so bata kare ba don haka ya jaya amma abun bai dakatar da komi ba sai da an kai zaben kuma duka esco din ibrahim shehu da yasa su suka yi imagine a cikin kundin pdp na zababbin esco gwamnati lokaci aka je primary election aka yi parallel mu muka yi danba su suka yi nasu wani wuri aka dauki nasu the same jigo a jam'iyyar wanda ka fada aji wanda kowa mutunci da girma mawa gare shi take ya yi fashion case din nan har supreme court kaddara Allah ba ta yi mu zamu zanna ku jera ba ma daga 2019 zuwa yau da mun zanna aka yi wannan ta kare the same jigo ya daga waya ya kira honorable dr injida ibrahim shehu ba kauye gusau bayan gwamnati mai ci yanzu ya yi defective ya koma apc bayan an samu matsaloli ga sunan barkatai ba sai na koma ba da ke da ni da duk wanda a cikin jihar ya sani yace ka koma pdp ibrahim yace a zai yi gaddama yace in mahaifin ka na da rai ba zai yi ba in maka magana ka tsaya gaddama na sani na ma ba dai dai ba ba dai ba ba biyu ba ba uku ba ka dawo ka cece ni ka cece jam'iyyar pdp ka cece mutanen zamfara the same ibrahim shehu mit shehi yana kan din shi yace ina son a kira mitin an ka kira mitin marigayi sakir hamida yana cikin mitin Allah shi kai rahama cikin kabari shi dr dauna lawan dare wanda ake magana da mutun kan shi yanzu yana cikin mitin koguna yana cikin mitin kabiru marafa yana cikin mitin distinguished former a senator da kuma dan takar senator a central na apc din yanzu a wanga yanki suna ciki da ibrahim shehu din yan musu sallama yace zai tafi pdp ba don ra'ayi ne bane kunji 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 duka wadanda annan suka yi mefa ta alfiri hadda dauda hadda dauda ya tafi kwatsam 22 ga wata na hudu ana sauran kasa ga wata guda a primary na pdp the same dauda ko ibrahim cewa zan tafi in sai form da pdp yace kada ka fara because in ka fara fada ne na hahada hujjoji na da gaskiya ba zan fara yet he did not listen to that statement he went ahead to do abun da amma i don't know whether you are getting me very well yanzu with this da na fada miki addinance shin an yadda a bari mu bili ya bari a sare ga rabi so biyu ba yadda ba mu ci bi ba yadda ba so biyu ba yadda ba ko to wanda an ka sara so huduwa duka hukuncin guda ne dai ba hukuncin guda ne ko ba dai dai bane yanzu ga wadan ga bayanan da nan miki na ab position din ibrahim shehu ba kauye ba shi a ibrahim ba kk a ibrahim kina da hujjoji mi zaki zata zata nemi haƙƙin ta an kuma hodi addinance sulhu alheri shi ba nemi haƙƙi ibada ko ibada da alheri wannan a gaba ibada a gaba to muna nan ka haƙƙin mu to amma nan jihar zamfara kada su dauka mun yi ne domin mu hana pdp ta tsaye da dan takara ba shi bane mu abun da muke jahiyya ni da fulfill bi dan wannan duka jahiyyar da aka yi ka cokan wannan ticket legally is for ibrahim constitutionally is for ibrahim politically is for ibrahim socially is for ibrahim and otherwise and morally whatever you call it to amma yanzu idan ta tabbata pdp ba ta dan takara ya za ku ci ya ya za ku ji a ce ko asila hana mu pdp tsaye dan takara ya za ku ji a siyasance nation accomplished Eh? on these reasons maje tambaye ka ta karshe ba ka bukata in sauke da dalilan da yasa to ka ce mission accomplished let me let me mission accomplished are you catch me up go ahead a uh, mission accomplished in the sense that the same issue litigation tussle happened in zamfara in 2019 where the entire party loses all the seats kuma aka zanna which teach them a bitter lesson 
and they have now changed and they correct their abnormalities. This is so that at least it will be, you know, a one historic issue that at least one will, respect, yeah, one will respect electoral act, one will respect party constitution issue, one will respect electoral guideline. So, kiko ra chakari aja ha zampara abali wanda adede abashi abashi. Ujito mbe kitu kashi. Ah, to aida da siku arago dani. Di enda ka auna abisa gatsari na sharia. Kanga no chewa sharia namba dati ebaka wana abuba. Tum faruko mahaji ya sara tu dada akai judgment na faruko. Anto ki solid matakai na suluhu. Aka zanda aga table na suluhu. Kama ya nanichi, haraka suluhu, give and take me. In resolving conflict of every issue na kuwachi ili mkuma, ekatachi kusi asa. Na so atashi, no victor, no. Yeah, no winner. Kai, as a person, you need to apply one na parameter in. Na kwa yuko last program da kuu. Ta DPT. Diagnosis, prognosis, and the therapy. You diagnose the problem. What caused it? You study it properly. In the course of one study, in you make an extract. Kazaya kau kaza, kazaya kau kaza. You package them, you keep them. Come for therapy. Solution to it. Inza asamu solution. Party A move ten yard. Party B move ten yard. Meet at the center. Party A you will lose this. Party B you will lose this. Harmoniously say I have to say I resolve the issue. Come and be Yet I can see kai mutumenda Allah ya kala ma kachi baze ya bukoma ina da. Toh, masukkan nama anda maja akalar wana tetono ada nasuru Ahmad Zabar ma, ah tetono aje, wad nasuru ada Muzabar masuri, tetono aje wad demo kai, kuma wad tujuh anci dikitari kita siasat jam ir PDP, do kuma makuma da si, kuma en siasat jidan su kapital suki kalam ma ita jam ir PDP azab en sekarat ada dua view da acuan da aku, mana aku dia rakas sama dama kalau tuan tetono, wad tak kecikir da ilmi da pada karwa. da kuma jan hankali musamman ga su ɗan siyasa su fahimci cewa ga kowane irin al'amari akwai abin da ya kamata a cikin azashi bisa abin da ya kamata in the series of sura yana a koda yoshi sai naga kana dauko aboki na adamu mahaifi ga mahaifi na kamar ahmad din da haka kamata ka dan sashi saboda shi adamu is a friend to alhamdulillah a madadin dukkanin waɗanda suka saka hannunsu da aboki ya gabatarwa ta ni a dan sanan an ka nake ce muku ma'asala Tonda Blows Online TV Tonda Blows